What's going on guys, Jeff here for Premium Aquatics and today we're going to be taking a look at some products from Flipper. Welcome back and if you're new to what we're doing here, this is where we take a look at new products each and every week to help you make an informed decision on what is right for you, your reef tank, and your budget. And this week we're going to be taking a look at three products from Flipper, so let's jump into it. What's up guys? So we got a brand new box from Premium Aquatics. Sorry for the greasy looking box that was on the porch. It's raining out today and we got a new box open up for you we're gonna take a look at what we got inside and talk it over all right so all the different items in here we got the flipper flipper pico which is fitting because we just started the pico build not that long ago for glass aquariums up to a fourth inch thick uh, one of the best scrapers in the business now they have a pico version pretty excited about that looks like they got felt on the back looks like a pretty aggressive little scraper there and we got flipper flip kick for your foam so you got some uh, lenses there and it looks like it goes for the new phones that are out there with uh, the iphone 11s which i do not have an iphone 11 but I'm sure this is going to work just fine for it so we got that to take a look at orange lens filter 15 kelvin then a yellow for 20,000 kelvin uh, magnetically attached that's awesome a lens holder kickstand that's even better protective carrying case and clip so we'll open that up take a look at that the next up we got the flipper deep sea max this is a magnified viewer it can work on glass or acrylic up to three fourths thick so 20 millimeters um, always have wanted to take a look at one of these guys very awesome and we're gonna have to put that to work and with between this and the ability uh, to tone down the blues of the tank should be able to take some pretty awesome photos with our phone so um, that's what we got in the box this week we got the deep c max the flipper pico and the flipper flip kick so uh, three awesome products from Flipper. Um, we're going to go ahead and open up the Flip Kick and take a look at these other two and see how well they work with the reef tank. All right, so I mean, there's not a whole lot to that. You basically have this big magnifying glass uh, that's attached to a magnet. Um, then we got the Pico, which I don't know if I can. Yep, I can. All right, so this is what goes inside the tank. You have the Velcro side, which is going to actually. Uh, clean up the glass and then this is the handle so if you have some really crazy stuff going on you got something that's a little bit more aggressive if you want to use the velcro side um, you just flip it around and then it sticks so if you're going to use the plastic tooth side then if you want to use the other side you just flip it around it works that way too so pretty strong little magnet right there you can hear that snap Oh, there it goes again pretty tiny so if you are looking for something that's discreet that's going to keep your glass clean i believe it's just glass yep for glass tanks that velcro is probably going to be too aggressive for acrylic um, but for those glass pico tanks that are looking for a good scraper flipper one of the best in the game solid product take a look at the flipper pico very awesome next up we got the flip kick see what we got wow that is a nice little case got a little carabiner there so you can clip it on to your pants but that is an extremely nice case very well done flipper continues to impress all right so it screws on which that's good you got aluminum frame construction you got your orange lens your yellow lens little lens cloth so i got my phone so these are to stick on your phone in a position where that magnet can actually grab it and then it's going to keep that in place. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and install uh, this piece of metal on the back of my phone uh, to get a better look at seeing how this whole thing works. So what I'm going to do instead of just like guessing where it's going to go on my phone, I'm actually going to put it onto the magnet itself and then line the magnet up to where I would like that to be. 
and then give it a good press. I'm gonna hold it there for a couple of seconds and that should stick real well. And then we have our plate on there, much like I have this travel plate to be able to quickly attach the flip kick and have that lens in place. So there it is. These don't, you know, stay on there forever. They actually are pretty easy to remove. Very quickly, I can take the flipper kick, put it on there, and we're good to go. We can start taking some pictures with the uh, phone. So uh, pretty interesting product. Let's go over to the reef tank and put this guy to work and see what we can take for photos. All right, so we're over at the reef tank and I'm gonna take a picture of some of the corals here on this frag rack. And what I'm gonna do is start off um, just taking a normal photo of the corals. All right, so now we have the yellow lens. We're gonna quickly attach that and then take a, another photo here. What I really like about the uh, flip kick is how quick you can swap out the lenses. Um, so we're gonna try out the orange lens now. So we took a picture of these corals right here with the yellow lens, which the yellow lens is for 15,000 Kelvin. Then the orange lens, which is geared towards 20,000 Kelvin, which is probably closer to what my tank is at right now. These lights just kicked on about a half an hour ago. So ultimately the flip kick is going to help you put out some really interesting photos. So definitely impressed with the flipper flip kick. Um, the case is absolutely amazing. I really like the lenses. I think that it takes good photos and you team that up with the Deep Sea Max. Um, you're going to take some really interesting photos with your iPhone. So if you're interested in this product, I definitely would take a look at it. So last but not least, uh, we've got the big dog here, the Deep Sea Max. Go ahead and open this up, take a quick look at it, see what it's all about. Then we're going to take it and place it into the reef tank and get a better look at it. So essentially what this does, this magnet stays on the inside. This one's on the outside. You have felt on there, so you don't have to worry about it scratching up your glass. And then you just have a really beefy magnifying glass to kind of get some really awesome looks at your corals or even take some pretty cool pictures. All right, so let's go jump over to the reef tank and take a look at the Deep Sea Max. All right, so as far as installing the flipper Deep Sea Max, the oh, water feels pretty cold right there. Uh, it's pretty easy to do. You just put the puck on the inside and the glass piece stays on the outside. And I'm gonna tell you right now, this is pretty awesome already. So I was kind of worried about the magnet on this frag rack. It works out perfect because the magnet's way up here on the top, so it isn't interfering at all. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take a picture of the coral without the lenses, and I'm gonna put on each lens and show you guys what that looks like as well. All right, so, First things first, we're gonna take a picture with the cell phone with nothing but just the Flipper Max and what I got. I'm gonna have to close some blinds. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit with just the way things are. Now we're gonna take the orange lens, put that on, that's how easy that is. And then take a picture with that, that's pretty cool. Now we're gonna swap it out for the yellow lens. So we got yellow lens on there, now it's on phone again this is an older iphone so that is pretty cool um so i'm going to share these photos i'm going to drop them into the video so you guys can take a look at them between the flipper deep sea max and the flip kick uh, you can really take some amazing photos of your tank very very impressed um, so if you guys want to take a look at these products dive a little bit deeper or do some more research there's going to be links in the description below which will bring you to premium aquatics where you can do just that all right, folks, that's going to do it for today's video. I want to thank you for joining me. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell so you can be notified every time that we upload a new video. If you enjoyed this one, hit the thumbs up, and I will see you next week right here with a brand new video.